How many moles and atoms, using Avogadro's number, are there in 45.01 grams of copper? My setup here starts with the 45.01 grams of copper, uses the molar mass of copper, 63.55, and we go over to the periodic table. The number under copper on the periodic table is the molar mass in grams of copper, so that's where we get it. And then mathematically, we divide 45.01 by 63.55 to get 0 0.708. I've rounded this to three sig figs, uh, and that's always good for lecture, homework, quizzes, and uh, anything else except lab. And from there, I took this 0 0.708 moles and I used uh, Avogadro's number because Avogadro's number is one mole of copper, since copper is an atom, is equal to 6.022 times 10 to the 23rd atoms of copper. And when I multiply these two numbers together, I get 4.26 times 10 to the 23rd atoms of copper. Now, if you kept the whole number up here and plugged that in down below, that's fine as well. Um, and because I will always be able to tell you, um, tell those, tell th that you've done that correctly. Uh, although I do appreciate if your final answer is to three sig figs, or in this case, since the initial statement had four, the initial number had four sig figs, you could leave it to four sig figs. So please don't write all the digits in your final answer, even if you carry all the digits through. Uh, the parts of your calculations before that.